can be nearly impossible to buy for, but your dad still needs something special this weekend. And one way to show your gratitude is with a Father's Day gift from Colonial Wines and Spirits. Plus, today just happens to be National Dry Martini Day, so you can observe that on Father's Day if you want. Colonial's Clark Trim joins us today with some hints that'll put Dad maybe in the right frame of mind or a smile on his face on his special right. day. Good to see you. Good to see you. Happy Friday. Thank you. Thank you. Good to have you here. And, you know, most dads, if, if they do enjoy liquor, they, they're a Scotch man or they're a bourbon guy. Right. So you've got something for everybody. Yeah, and you know, shopping for dad in Colonial is like uh, shopping for a, a kid in a candy store. There's something for everyone there. Uh, but, but for Father's Day, we usually think about a couple of categories that are really popular for, for dads, and right. that would be bourbons. Bourbons are extremely hot, uh -huh. really enjoying um, resurgence in popularity over the last couple of years to the point to where some of them are just almost impossible to find. Right. And then this, there, is one. this is one. Mm -hmm. uh, this is not the uh, most uh, difficult one to find. We have this in stock, and we can uh, supply it, no uh -huh. problem. But it is a great bourbon. Uh, and it, it definitely is one that any father would be proud of. The next category is uh, single malt scotch. Right. That's a huge category. Uh, you, you know, single malt is kind of the, it's a upper, it's a connoisseur's choice. Let's mm -hmm. just put it that way. And this particular one we're showing here today is um, McAllen 12-year-old. McAllen is what most scotch riders call the Rolls Royce of single malt scotches. Uh, it's just a, a the standard yes, it, and yeah. if dad enjoys a good scotch he might not splurge on this one so that would be something special absolutely that'd okay. be a great gift and if dad's a wine drinker you well have that too? dad's uh usually like to enjoy heavier large big bold red wines mm -hmm. we have a huge selection uh, across the store in every category what we picked here today is a cabernet sauvignon it's great for uh grilling Anything uh, red meat coming off the grill with this Cabernet is a perfect fit. Absolutely. Right. He would Absolutely. love that. Yeah. Okay, and we're going to go to Jen. We were talking about Martini Day being yeah. today. Today happens to be National Martini Day. Mm -hmm. um, this is my favorite, Jen, personally. Uh, it's made with 21 botanicals. Most others are made with around four or five. And uh, it's just got layer upon layer upon layer of different um, uh, complexities, mm -hmm. herbs, fruits, and but this it's it's just a wonderful martini gin. It's Clark's favorite. So it's my there favorite. You go. I mean, it's I love the Citadel. it. I'm so happy it's back in the state. It went away for a while. Now it's back, and I'm glowing because it's uh, it's just <laughs> I can that, tell you that happy. great. That's that it's that great of a <laughs> that's product. That's awesome. Uh -huh. So and then of course uh, uh, for vodka martini lovers, Grey Goose is uh, a great product. There are many of them out there. When I make a martini, you know, martinis are so versatile. You can do almost anything with a martini right. today, and great mixologists are doing that. A lot of people just like the standard, which is the gin, the vodka, a little bit of dry vermouth, shake it all up good, yep. either pour it over rocks and enjoy it on the rocks, or put it in your chilled martini glass. With a couple of these great olives, yeah. you got a great martini. You got a great martini. You've got a great gift idea here for Dad if he loves to have a good drink. So uh, let's remind everybody, of course, where Colonial is, of course, over there on West Markham. And there's your website as well. Right. Happy Father's Day to all of our dads out there. Absolutely. Thank Happy you. Father's Day. Thank you for being here, Clark. It's always a pleasure. Ideas.